started by going to the top navigation bar and selecting the desktop from the drop down menu. Then click on the dashboard you want from the list. On the right side you will now find the global filter. It helps you filter away unwanted information and spot what's important. For example, you can choose specific employees and all reports on the dashboard will update based on your request. At the top of each report you will find shortcuts where you can choose filters for the specific element. Click on the button to set the filter. Beside each element, you will notice the Action tab. Here you can also set filters, define chart properties, duplicate elements, maximize charts, export information, and change the type of data visualization. Beside the global filter in the top menu, there is a main menu. The options available in the main menu depend on your user profile. You may be a user, system administrator, designer, or developer. To set your favorite dashboard as the default startup, click on Set as Default Desktop in the main menu. On top, you can change your profile. Upload your picture and set your language preference. When you're done, Click on Business Analyze logo to go home to your default desktop. Sometimes you want to share your dashboards with other people in your organization. In the main menu, you can send an email with a link to the dashboards. The recipient needs a user license to view the dashboard. In the main menu, you also have access to the input module. Use the input module to set targets, for example, revenue targets or number of booked meetings. If you are a system administrator, the main top menu navigation is similar in the administration user interface. Here you can manage users manage access rights, and perform other tasks. There are several new reports that provide you with information about usage patterns and system status. If you want to create or customize a dashboard, it's easy for designers and developers. Go to the desktop where you want a new dashboard. Choose Edit Desktop and add a new tab. Then add the tab Details. Click on the Action tab to make design changes. Use the Business Analyze toolbox to find templates to help you build dashboards. Choose the folder, then a template, and drag and drop onto the dashboards. Publish when you are done, and then you can tune the dashboard with the right data and labels. Thanks for joining. Remember to sign up for our newsletter.